There is nothing Sudar Shamgodam doesn't do. That includes climbing mountains. The 29-year-old student and former social worker in Nepal already conquered Mount Yala without artificial arms or oxygen in 2005. That was really exciting and excellent work for myself, I think for the people too, because without arms it is really challenging things for the human. Godin lost his arms when he was a teenager after being injured when he touched high voltage overhead wires. His arms were amputated and Godin never looked back. He says he wanted to do unique work and summiting Everest without artificial arms is just that. Godin is confident he will reach the top. And I manage my, uh, my body is like uh, balanced and uh, I use my mouth too to catch the rope and uh, I know how to balance my body. It will be easy for me. He says he will summit from the Tibet side of Mount Everest in 2012 and already has Sherpas in place. Godin will spend three months in Nepal increasing his chances of success. It will be a great uh, inspiration and uh, I want to give this uh, all program for the charity people who need our support, uh, especially for the Nepalese people like disabled people and poor people. Godin wants to build a hospital and school in rural Nepal. He calls climbing Mount Yala a stepping ladder to Everest. Godin says disability is not inability. People attitude is the biggest disability in their life. If you are positive and uh, if you think all things are like positively, you can, you can get success everywhere. Shelley McCrugan, CTV News, Calgary.